Uh, today, really excited here. I'm looking at balls, specifically golf balls. Um, these ones. So these are some of the ones that I think are going to go the furthest for me. Highest ball speed, longest distance. Um, and I've done a little bit of testing in my garden net that I want to test it on. Something like this. So we've got the usual kind of suspects. We've got Callaway, Chrome Soft, XLS. We've got Shrixen Z Star XV. We've got Bridgestone Tour BX. That's Bryson's Golf Ball, or it used to be Bryson's Golf Ball. Uh, and we've got the Pro V1 X Left Dash. And we've got the standard Pro V1 as well. And there's actually two other balls as well. So we're going to give these a bash. We're going to go with my five best seven irons for each of them. Uh, and see which one's got the longest distance and the best ball speed. And then we're going to go with driver and see what happens with that as well. So let's have a look. So first up, we're going to go seven iron with the Pro V1. Good old Pro V1. Everyone loves it. Oh, that was a good strike. Bad. Turned it over a bit, but that's a better strike. That's a bit more like my seven iron. Okay, let's get a few more of those in. Mm. It's okay. Take that. Yeah, that's not a bad strike. We've got five good ones yet. That's better. That's better. All right, let's do a really hard one. Oh, it's so high. Okay. So that was Pro V1. Okay. Time for the Callaway Chrome Soft XLS. See what this does. Not bad strike. It's almost out the middle. See, Pro V1, I just think, <laughs> not for me. Just don't get the ball speed with it. Oh, turned it over a bit, but turned it over a lot. Oh, that's gone in someone's garden, that has. And 200 yards though, isn't it? Bad. Ah, 
That's all right, that. Yep. Ooh, 130 ball speed. Yes, please. Well, this I'm getting a bit more consistency now. Seven. That was a bit slower. That's gone all right though. Okay. So that was the chrome soft. Right. So now. Okay, Shrixen. Well, that's the closest we've had to a line ball. And it was pretty decent as well. Not a bad opener for that. Another good strike. Smothered that, but that's a bit lower, which is good. Oh, what's happened there? Right, that's annoying. I've lost to restart this, so I don't know if it's gonna have the data in comparison, but there we go. Never mind, right, we're on Shrixen. Let's try and hit a really hard one. Oh, right out of the bottom. Yeah, okay. That's the tricks I'm done. Below. But that's pretty good. Hi. That's so high. I wish I could hit a golf ball sometimes properly. Do it properly. Toey, but okay. Need to carry 180 for a slightly heavy tie. Might be the best one yet. <sighs> nah, it hasn't gone far, but it was accurate. Okay, this one I'm excited for, Left Dash Pro V1 X. This is the one that normally seems to be the best, so. Let's see if the numbers work out that way. Oh. Well, that's one of my best strikes. <laughs> Line ball, nearly, and that's gone a good way. I swear, if this doesn't win, I'll be, I'll be shocked. I will be shocked. 
I wasn't even trying to hit that one. Oh, and it's gone miles, so. Bit pulley, bit turning over. But it's carried decent, and I wasn't trying to kill it again. This has to win. Turned it over, but a bit heavy, maybe. It's good though. Yeah, that was all right. I don't mind that. No, nope, not like that, you went. Bottomy. No, it's staying straight. Oh. That's better. Let's finish on that. That was a good strike out of the middle. Yeah, good. Good shot. Okay, that's all of those ones done. We're going to go for secret special option, the Shrix and Distance. Let's see how that does. Shot. Shrix and Distance then. Not expecting it to be better than any of those, but if it's about there, then it's worth the money, isn't it? Well, it's got the accuracy factor <laughs> straight away. Hey, it's in the 190s, total distance. Ball speed's not amazing, but hey, that spin's low, isn't it? 4,000 on a seven line. That could be the trick here. <laughs> wow, the distance is good, and that's, it's so interesting, the ball speed is down. Right, maybe with some good shots there. But I mean, that, that's three in a row that I won't have to edit anything out. I mean, the ball speed's consistent, the spin is just so low. 3,800 spin on a seven, right? Oh, that was a shank. Oh, hello. What a shot. That's not bad. Okay, last one with the tricks in. That wasn't bad either. Let's try and give it some beans. Bad strike. One more. Well, that is a good ball. It's so much cheaper, but it's just the spin. I can't get the spin in the 5,000s.
So yeah, what we can see there is, it's unfortunately not recorded the other ones, but we've got on the Shrixen Z Star 124 mile an hour ball speed average, backspin 5098, uh, 179 average, carry 190 total. Um, left dash, we've got 4700 spin, launching slightly higher. And we've got 184 yards of carry on average, 196. So that's carrying five yards further than the Shrixen and rolling out six yards further. And then the Shrixen budget the distance. This is the thing, we've got 4,100 spin. We've got one as low as 3,600. Um, we've got 182 average carry. So it's just behind the left dash, but it's rolling out almost as far 195 because it's just dead spin and the ball speed is interesting so the ball speed on the left dash is 125.9 so 126 miles an hour whereas the shrixen distance is only 121 so the ball speed is far less but the spin is so much less so it's kind of deader in the air so probably quite good off the irons for distance but coming into green is not so great and i'm guessing off the tee not great either. So for budget purposes, the tricks and distance is, is worth it, a third of the price. But if you're looking for all round total distance and decent-ish spin, then, well, the left dash, that's my preferred choice, but it's you're looking at 50 pounds a box, which is just crazy. Whereas the Shrix and Z-Stars, this is the prior generation that I've got. That is far cheaper you can get them for about 25 pounds a box and you get a little bit more spin. You're getting almost the same carry, maybe slightly less carry, um, but you're getting decent ball speed. So that's it for the seven iron testing. I'll be testing out drivers and see how it goes on the spin on that. Thanks for watching. If you're still here at the end, thanks for watching anyway. Uh, like, subscribe, follow, all that good stuff. Thanks a lot.